Well, now we've got the awning. Yeah, well, we can do things on the top, like we can fit more cameras, we can um, put some more solar up there. What? We do all sorts of things like that on, on the roof. Things that we couldn't do before. Because. What? what? No. I mean, no, yeah. We don't need any more cameras. <laughs> we always need, you always need cameras. We've I got mean, cameras. Anyway, so we can get on there, and my plan is to get another solar panel, right? And we can put this. What? You said we were having a little decking area up there. You can't just then go and change your mat. <sighs> you won't go up there. She doesn't like heights, and we got no ladder. And she won't get up oh, there in the ladder. ladder. So, so yeah, that, that that is the beauty about having a mule awning. But well, we can do things like that, can't we? An awning. <laughs> you said it twice. I know. <laughs> Have I? <laughs> Dear me, it started already. <laughs> Won't be laughing by the end of the day. <laughs> so <laughs> we've got the mule roof rack now and there's loads of things we can do so on the top of it we can put a little deck and pass we can put some more solar we can fit some more cameras that is the beauty about having one of these all you know sexy looking roof racks isn't it yes mm, um, no cameras there we've got enough well, yeah. yeah, so we've got a little job to do because this has been an ongoing discussion in our house for a while. <laughs> it's caused many an argument. It hasn't been an argument. It's just been a heated discussion. Yeah, argument And you came to my way of thinking, that's all. Why are you stroking me? I'm not on the zoo. Because you had something fluffy on you. Okay, anyway, so what are we doing, Em? Fitting an awning. Fitting an awning. So we were away at Van Life Eats and we were going around and we were looking at all the vans. What did you all have? Awnings. Mmm, awnings. Now, the problem we've got is we couldn't do one, could we? No. Because we had 41 mil uni struts on top, we just couldn't fit an awning onto the roof of this van. It just wasn't possible. It just, we couldn't do it. But we can now, can't we? Yes. Why can we do it? Because we've got a mule roof rack. A m m mule <laughs> roof rack. <laughs> got a m m mule roof rack. No, oh, a mule shut one. Up. This you is were a calling special it a one. morning before. A special one. This is a m m mule roof rack. <laughs> a m m mule roof rack. You alright there? Trying to make yourself feel better about earlier. Yeah, you? whatever. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> so we're going to get. Yeah, I'm going to send Anna up there. Who? Anna. <laughs> uh, that's a new name. Anna. Meet Anna, and I'm dogging. <laughs> what? Dogging. You going dogging? No, dogging. What? It's, it's Welsh for Prince. <laughs> Prince of what? Gas and wind. We got one of them. A great big box. What's in the box? Well, you know what's in the box. It's an awning. <sighs> right. Let's get this sucker open. It does seem a bit bigger than what we've ordered. First problem we're having is getting it out of the box. <laughs> So that is what we've gone for, the fuel. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> the what? Om oh. Omnistore. Mister? Store. There's no E on the end. Oh, there's an R on it. Omnistore. Om. Ne. Store. Omnistore. Right, so we've got all the stuff out here, instruction manual, we've got mountain plates, fixing plates. It does come with three actual mountain plates, which are those two end ones and one middle one. Now, these are really simple. So these are going to fit up there onto the side like that. And then this little slot, which is right there, what that does, if my glamorous assistant can flip the boy over... So you have a rail, you've got a rail that's under there. This part, when this is bolted onto the top up there, this bit will be sticking out like that. And that literally just hooks into there like that. And then the bottom sits on this channel there like that, nice and snug. And then you screw it in the bottom there with some self tappers, which come with the kit as well. And that's all that really holds it on. So we've got three of these to mount, two big ones, one little one. So we need to evenly space these out, so we've got one fixing there, 
We've got one fixing in the middle, and then we've got one fixing even at the very end as well. Right, let's get on the roof, start measuring stuff up, and go from there. Okay, we've worked out where the actual middle bracket is going to go. That's going to go literally five inches off the side here, straight up to the top up there. We're going to mount this one first, and we're actually going to do it level with the top of the roof rack. So this lip here is going to be level with the top of the roof rack so the actual awning will sit just a little bit higher than the roof rack itself because that gives us basically the more space and the the better fixing points rather than going through the holes that are in the awning yes we will have to drill into the awning which is not an awning it's a roof rack but i'd rather have the right size hole than have a bigger hole that's going to over time move around and mess about so i'll get this one mounted and then uh, I'll show you. So I got the first one mounted there and I did draw a line just like that. I did draw it with the set square so you can see that it is level. Um, just drew a little line down there to get it. That is now in and like I said I just done the bottom lip with that. I just done the bottom lip level with that so it will sit on top of there like that. The reason is because we have only got the single light barred roof rack but the double one is just a little bit higher. Now, some people who do have the single roof rack as well, compared to the double light barred one, they've noticed because there's that little bit much, just a slight bit of a difference in the height when they actually mount the awning, it's really close to the bodywork. Now, that's not a problem, but when you're actually getting your arm in to unwind it, it kind of hits the roof, like sort of here. So, We've just raised it up just a little bit, just to give it enough clearance. It's still got loads of strength on there. That's fine in there. Don't forget, the whole weight is going to be sitting down on here as well. It's going to be screwed in the bottom and all good. Right, middle one's on. We've got to get the front one on and then mount the back one. As you can see, there's two plates already mounted. Just need to get the back one mounted and then we all get to watch Neil fall off a ladder while trying to mount an awning. Yeah. It's kind of not funny, is it really? <laughs> <laughs> Make for a great video though, won't it? Someone's already done that. Who was yeah, that? but, you know, they weren't carrying an awning up a ladder, will they? Will they? Were they? <laughs> English oh, with Neil no. starts Wednesday. <laughs> it wouldn't be England then, would it? It's Spanglish. Nealish. Plates are all up and mounted. Three plates on, two big ones, and one middle one in the middle. Right, now the fun bit. I've got to get that up the ladder, hook it on top without dropping it, falling off, killing myself, smashing the thing up, yeah, wrecking it's, the van. It's, it's that second to last one that's the most likely out of the whole scenario. <laughs> I have complete and utter faith in you. It, it's got to be good viewing. <laughs> and I, I just hope the ladder stays intact while we're doing it as well. There's many things that can happen here. Get yourself a cup of tea. A couple of biscuits. Sit back. This could either be really boring, like the rest of the video was the uh, comment section saying just now. Eh, you're not very entertaining. <laughs> you already got that for free, didn't you? No, we didn't. We bought it. Anyway, we digress. I haven't said that for a while, have I? No. no. Right. You just wanted to work that I in, did, didn't yeah. you? Let's go to the ladder and um, attempt stupidity. Everyone's told me it's a two-man job, this. But, you know, as the T-shirt says, let's give it a go, Em. You and me, we're going to work together, son. This ladder stays all right.
<laughs> this might take two people. Grab another ladder. Try and stop. That was fun. Right, it's clipped on. Right, so it's clipped on to the top. What you gotta do now is we've gotta lift it just a little bit and push the front in at the same time so it's going to be the fun bit so I'm going to try the right that's the that's the front clipped in and mounted the middle's clipped in as well That is mounted. Whoop, whoop. Right, now it's up there, we've got to put these little self-tappers. They drill into the very bottom plate. They basically lock the front down. So the bottom of the actual awning, they drill in. The self-tappers, they're on star drives. So get up there, and you have two in the front, two in the back, one in the middle. We've eventually got it up. It's up, it's secured. <laughs> you got it up. It's up, secured. Right, now to test if it comes out. We should be okay because we think we left enough room there for it to miss the camera and get the bar in to unwind it. Right, where's the stick? I don't know, up your ass. Right. Oh, 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 oh. oh shit. Oh, oh, oh. Right, thing I like about these two lawns is the legs are in there but you have a little clip on the side here which you have to pull out to release the leg and then they lock in you can just see there and then another good thing which Emma found so up here you have I still can't reach two little metal holes that when you've got your own and extended they're going to slip into there, aren't they? Yeah, there's little grooves there and you just slip them in. Once they're slipped in there, it adds a little bit of extra strength onto your awning once it's fully extended. Now, I don't think I've seen that on other awnings. I could be wrong. I've not really inspected awnings. <laughs> but there you go. Um, it's a nice little extra feature though, isn't it? Just yes. Just to right. give a bit more strength. Now, we've got to fit the feet to the van so that the dogs, when they're out, I'm not going to get wrapped around the actual poles like that because we don't want it like that. We want the awning sort of fixed onto the side of the van. So it comes with feet, doesn't it? Yes. Right, go get feet. Let's go drill. Right, it comes with these little black feet, but it also comes with white ones as well. We put the white ones on the side. They literally just flip up and clip down so the actual legs will fit in there and clip into place. One at the back. One at the front. No doggy tanglement. Yay! Our problem's getting that up. <laughs> Just a few. It's a little tiny bit heavy. Don't do this on your own. No. I mean, to be fair, I have purposely, to finish this video off, gone and um, put a new t-shirt on. I'll let you read it. Kind of explains me. Not really the thing you want to do on your own, is it? No. 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 Not to no. be recommended. No. There was a struggle. I've never struggled that hard to get it up. No, that's a lie. Um, but it's up and it works perfect. And that is a game changer, isn't it? For, for us with the dogs and everything else, yes. Massive. Perfect. And 
we genuinely, genuinely couldn't have done that without the mule roof rack being on it. Even though I kept saying mule awning. <laughs> the mule roof rack. Couldn't have done it. Um, so yeah, that is just another use case scenario that these roof racks can be totally modular and you can do all sorts with them. But yeah, having an awning um, is going to be great. And to be fair, we you're getting this now. We did fit this a couple of weeks ago and we've used it, haven't we? Yes. Right, and we've used it in sun. Yeah, I know it's getting a little bit... I'm in the rain. But rain, yes. Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. So it just Winner. gives you that little bit of extra room for the dogs, for, for your other animals that you've got with you, you know, so they can sit out. Right, I'm going now. So, yeah. Wasn't easy. Wasn't a two-man job, though. No, it was a one-idiot job. Bye. I want them spots that just keep coming up. <laughs> right, we're going. Really. We're going. Um, we've got friends here tomorrow. Ooh. Mm, we'll be doing some work, so that'll be happy days, won't it? Oh. Bye bye. <laughs>